This time we'll be working with triggers. Let's bring up that Antares graph and get started. Triggers are functions which are set in motion when something occurs within the virtual world. In this particular case we're gonna make a wall, technically it's a door, disappear and reappear when the avatar moves through it. As you can see our object is already in the hierarchy and it's helpfully called trigger. Let's drag it into the graph. Immediately we're gonna bring up the logic block settings windows you'll see. This is gonna determine the object's behavior. Previously we did a transform, but this time we're gonna do a mesh renderer. That one governs an object's visibility. There it is. And now we're gonna create several more functions to play around with. Uh, we need one function to make the mesh, the 3D object, visible, and another one to make it invisible. We'll search for a mesh renderer setting to create this toggle. Alright, we, we've connected the function to the variable it's going to affect. Now we'll add the toggle that was mentioned just now. We're looking for activators that check for an object entering and exiting their fields. Those are the onTriggerEnter and onTriggerExit in the list. We could use advanced activators, you can see their branch right there, but that's something that'll be explored later. Basic ones are just fine for now. Now we'll link it to our visibility function and check the little checkbox to make sure that this one means true. Booleans are basic variables that mean true or false, as you should know. And here is our onTrigger exit activator. Let's copy and paste our mesh visibility function and link our trigger exit activator. We'll also need to have it linked to our variable. There, that looks good. As you can see, that one didn't have the boolean true checkbox, meaning it's gonna be false as in invisible. Let's play and see what happens. There's our engineer, let's watch him. Now keep an eye on the Antares graph to the right of the main window. When the functions execute, they're gonna briefly flash red, which is also a cool guide. There, you should have seen that. The wall blinked in and out of existence as the avatar walked through, and there it was again. Let's go slowly this time and keep an eye on the graph. There. Uh, saw that? Uh, back up and watch it again if you wish. Our program works. There's a lot to be said for the wonderful feeling when you've programmed something and it just works. Even when it's something as simple as this. Especially if it's as simple as this, in fact. Hope you've understood and enjoyed this tutorial.